What is going on everybody? It's me Yuril here and today's video is something very special because I recently reached 1,000 subscribers. I know that's not a lot and to be frankly with you that's only a thousand people in some people's minds but to me that's a big milestone. What I always wanted to do was really start making money off of YouTube so I can invest it on both of my cars whether it's the W203 or the W204. I can make more projects with these cars now that I'm starting to make money off of YouTube. That's pretty much a quite a bit of an achievement and I could have not done that without you guys and I really appreciate that because there's a lot of things we got to talk about with these cars that I have in mind for 2024 now that the year is ending. Now the past couple of months I just haven't really been prioritizing with my cars because I have a different business venture that I decided to invest in. So far it's going good however it requires a little bit more time and effort and now that things have a little bit changed with the monetization and whatnot I am more motivated to do this invest more into let's say a new project. And I feel like that's really something significant that has happened to me the end of 2023. 2023 with these cars have been very much no problems aside from the wagon. The wagon, long story short, uh, my engine seized because of the AC compressor. I got into a hit and run accident with that car. And I think that was pretty much a turning point in a way where I was like, you know what, what's the point of me making a video on the W203 when it's pretty much in a weird situation where it's all scratched up and whatnot. But hey, it's not the end of the world because now we could finally start working on it slowly. Both of my cars have been with me for the past two years and I've always just wanted to make videos of them out of curiosity. And uh, the problem with that is a lot of these cars, not a lot of people talk about. And so for the most part, I mean, some people don't even know a C350 exists or a C240 wagon exists. There's very little information about them. And even if there is information, there's not a lot of updated topics about them, whether it's in 2022, 2023, or even 2024, nobody talks about these cars because they're pretty much irrelevant. People want the best and people want the latest. And I think for me personally, I like to appreciate a lot of things in the past, such as these types of cars. And although these cars are over a decade old, that doesn't mean that they're irrelevant or obsolete. And in a way they are in technology, but I mean, that's to be expected, right? What matters to me is the driving pleasure. What matters to me is how well they are capable still in 2024 now. That's really one of the reasons why I'm just really into these cars and making these videos, whether it's repair videos, updated reliability videos, or all sorts of those types of videos. I think I just really like doing those because I know a lot of people are curious about these because they, they don't really exist at all on the internet. And I'm gonna keep going. I think uh, I would like to keep both of these cars, whether it's the wagon or this, uh, for a good while. And honestly, now that this is very much sentimental to me, both of these cars, I really have a hard time letting them go unless something happens, not good metal. <laughs> but overall, I'd like to say again, thank you so much for making me reach a thousand subscribers. It's just a lot more opportunities for both of these cars, for more projects, for more videos. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys later.